Hey, how are you guys? Recently I've got some questions about the regex groups capturing groups in uh, Auto Voice, and I'm just going to show you how it works and how to set up these commands uh, with uh, Tasker. So basically you have to use a bit of an imagination here because I've got a few colorful lights in here that we're going to be uh, toggling on and off. And you can imagine those are lights in like living room or kitchen or wherever switches you want to do, etc. And we're going to use the task profile in Auto Voice uh, to kind of voice enable uh, the switches as well. So I'm going to show you that now. OK, Google, please turn on all lights. Okay, the all will get turned on. Okay, Google. Please turn off blue light. Okay, the blue will get turned off. Okay, Google. I want to turn off red light. Okay, the red will get turned off. Let's have a look and see what's happening in Tasker. So we have a event condition, auto voice uh, recognized, and uh, we're setting up a command filter in the following way. To create a group, we are using brackets and a question mark. Uh, now, to name the group, uh, we're using the angled brackets, and that's going to be the variable in which you're going to store uh, the value so first one is uh, command second is status and the uh, last one is color now you see the pipe here separating two words uh, these pipes basically it's or symbol in regex so you can either use for example lights and lights and in a status message here you can use on and off and in a color you can use uh, blue red or all we obviously going to select use regex to perform this activity. The command regex groups has been only created to allow me to choose different uh, command options like I'd like to or please. Now let's have a look at the task. First I've got stop just to handle exception. Then we're setting two variables which I'm going to pass in auto tools SSH plugin as arguments for my uh, function and then say will be a confirmation of that um, profile. Whenever I say command out loud, um, Tasker basically assign the color to the variable color, assign the status to on or off, and pass it over to my Raspberry Pi. If you're interested in the Raspberry uh, Pi setup, the code is very simple, and just look into the uh, video description, you'll find it. Uh, and again, thank you so much for watching. Uh, visit my website for more tutorials and materials in regards to Raspberry Pi or Tasker, and subscribe follow me, etc. You know what to do. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.